So what is a seed? A seed essentially is a tiny package of genetics. On a very basic level, it's the method of reproduction for all flowering plants. Can we just acknowledge how amazing that is? A seed contains all that is needed to grow into a full-blown plant that will feed and nourish us and the many other living communities that it encounters in its life. A plant, if allowed, will set seed with many hundreds, if not thousands of seed to continue its genetics. Plants are inherently abundant. Less than a century ago, it would have been really normal for farmers and growers to embrace this abundance and this generosity and save some of their own seed. But somewhere along the way, we've forgotten that. We've forgotten the generosity of plants. Because the very nature of seed saving encourages you to share. It's very hard to be selfish when you're a seed saver. And in that way, seeds have the power to build community. They're asking to be shared, to be swapped and to be traded. Seeds also have the canny trick of adapting to local conditions. They form reciprocal relationships with the microbial life in the soil. They have microbiomes just like ours. And like ours, these are passed down through the generations. And this brings resilience. Seed saving is like saving a memory of that year and the many years beforehand. In our current climate chaos, think how valuable that could be to have plants that remember that summer drought or that cold, wet spring or that really early frost. Seeds are at the heart of our food system. Without them, we'd have very little to eat. Seeds are alive, they're beautiful, they're dynamic, and they have a lot to teach us.